Yes, by their fruits ye shall know them. The fruits of Joseph Smith's teachings and have withstood over 150 years of investigation, criticism, and persecution. The message, the church, and the people stand as a vindication of the truth of his testimony and works. Just as prophets of the past were without honor in their own countries and were persecuted and killed, Joseph Smith was maligned and martyred in his generation. Was Joseph Smith sent from God? We answer an emphatic yes. He lived great, he died great in the eyes of God and his people. And like most of the Lord's anointed, in ancient times was sealed, has sealed his mission and his works with his own blood. I testify to you that God has again spoken from the heavens, that the visitation of God the Father and the Son, Jesus Christ, constitutes the greatest event in this world since the resurrection of Jesus Christ. God lives, Jesus is the Christ, the redeemer of the world not just a great moral teacher as much of the Christian world is claiming, but the savior of mankind, the very son of God. I bear testimony that Joseph Smith was a prophet of the living God, one of the greatest prophets that has ever lived on the earth. He was the instrument in God's hand in ushering in the present gospel dispensation the greatest of all, and the last of all in preparation for the second coming of the Master. I bear witness that we have standing at the head of the church today a prophet of the living God who holds all the authority necessary to carry forward our Father's program for the blessing of his children. As God lives, I know these things are true and bear this witness to you in the name of Jesus Christ, amen.